Hello guys, welcome to Tech Help Line. I hope you all are doing well. Today you will learn how to add your ProtonMail account to Outlook on Windows with ProtonBridge. Before I start this video be sure to subscribe to this channel and do not forget to click on bell icon. So let's begin. First, you'll need to log into the Bridge app using your ProtonMail credentials. Click on the Add Account button, enter your username and password and click Next. Your account will be displayed in the Bridge app. Now click on your account username in the Bridge app to expand the option list and select Mailbox Configuration. You'll see a new pop-up window from Bridge showing the IMAP slash SMTP information. OK, so now we recommend opening Outlook on one side of your screen and the Bridge app on the other. In Outlook, select File from the menu bar and click on Add Account. Type in your email address and click on Advanced Options. Check the box next to let me set up my account manually and click Connect. On the next screen, select IMAP. Here's where you'll need to enter the IMAP slash SMDP information displayed from the Bridge app. Make sure you enter these details into Outlook exactly as they're displayed in the Bridge app. For incoming mail server, enter 127.0.0.1 and port number 1143. For outgoing, Enter 127.0.0.1 and port number 1025. Make sure for both encryption method fields the option is selected as None. When you've entered all of these fields, click Next. On this screen, you will need to enter a password. In the Password field, paste the password generated by the Bridge app and click Connect. Your account will now start loading in Outlook. Now let's configure some additional settings in Outlook to make sure everything will be working properly. Go to File Account Settings. Select Account Settings, select your ProtonMail account username, click on Change. And checkmark the option that says, Don't save copies of sent items. Even though you're enabling this option, your sent messages will still be saved in your save folder. Click on Next, and then click Done. Congratulations! Your ProtonMail account is now ready to use in Outlook. I hope you guys liked this video. I will see you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching this video and make sure to subscribe this channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon.